Hey guys, what's up? Welcome, welcome back to our channel. Now guys, today I have for you a hair video and it's all about my pixie cut. I'm going to show you guys how I do my hair like on a daily basis. So you know say you can't always get your dresser every week and something so you have to try it on your own. <laughs> so I'm going to show you guys how I mold my pixie cut with these waves at the front and then you know that's it. So if you guys want to see how I got this look then keep on watching guys. guys so this is what my hair is looking like at the moment um the last time i did my hair meaning went to a hairdresser was about three weeks ago so they fade in the back as you guys can see she did a little style around here and my hair is growing up um from that cut now so yeah it has been about three weeks since i last got a haircut but guys i'm loving this style so much it's so easy whenever i do um wrap or mold my hair it lasts me for like three or four days even five days you know it looks really good to like for three days and then day four day five you know it kind of the waves kind of start moving up but i did this hairstyle out like six days ago so yeah i'm gonna show you guys so the products that I use, very, very simple routine. This is the Lotta Body with Coconut and Shea Oil Wrap Foaming Mousse. It looks like this. I got this in Jamaica for $860. The price is still on it. And then the other product that I use is this Black African Pride Black Castor Miracle Oil. And this is very cheap as well. I got this in Jamaica. So normally I just take this and oil my scalp very easy. Just run it along like this. My scalp. Just to oil my scalp. And normally guys I would do this like on a damp hair. Like when I just wash my hair. I would usually do it, set it and you know just tight down for the night or whatever but my hair isn't damp now so I'm going to use a lot of mousse or you can damp it you can damp it after I just wash my hair I would usually just dry out some of the water out of it and then I add my mousse so I'm just going to start adding the mousse to one section because normally what happens is that it will dry down so I comb it forward with the mousse. Ensure that you part your hair in the way how you want it to be. And I usually do a side part. So that's my side part right there. So I just comb it down to take out the original style with the mousse. And I add more mousse because it has to be like really wet. Like the more mousse you add, it's the better, really. So I comb it down with the mousse and then I start to form the hair. So I just use a tail comb, a rat tail comb, and I just form some waves. So I use my middle finger and all the other fingers to hold down the wave. So as you can see, the wave is there and guys I usually have to try this several time to, times to get the perfect wave and guys I usually play with this a lot until I get it because I'm a bit of a perfectionist so let me just stop talking and you guys can just watch what I'm doing let's do this again
other side. And guys, the trick is to hold down the hair. Trick is to hold down the hair. Right, so I'm just gonna take out some of my baby hair. <laughs> I'm just going to take out some baby hair. And do just that, just that. And then for the top part here, I don't like when it's paste down on my head. So I usually form it, form this section right here at the front. And then for the rest of it, I paste it down to the back. So I'm going to just use a little bit of mousse for the top part right here. And I'm going to just form this part. So I just did that, right? Because I like that little part right there. And then far around here, I use the mousse and I paste on this part. So it depends on the shape that you want, guys. It depends on the shape that you want for your hair. So I paste on the back like that. And then for this part, I just lay it onto it. Because I love when the top of my hair have a little height like that. So that's all I do. So that's the side. And then after I do that, guys, I just focus on the back. So I take more moves and I just focus on the back. Then I use my hairbrush and I just brush it down. Alright you guys, so that's how I mold my hair in here. It's hot and getting sweaty. Now, people usually use that black wrap. I think they have it in different colors. And wrap their hair. But girl, I don't have that. I just use a regular scarf. And I just wrap it. So I just fold it into like this perfect rectangle. And I put it from the back. So I put it from the back. Like so. And then I just tie everything down like this. Right. And then I just tie it. And I just usually leave this on for a few hours or overnight. And that's it. So I'll come back to you guys when it is fully set. Alright, and ensure that it's really tight around your head. Alright you guys, see you soon. Alright you guys, so it has been about 4 hours, 4 to 5 hours since I tied on my hair. And this is what it's looking like, it's all the way dry. So this is it. Alright you guys, so that's the end of the video. Thank you so very much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe and share. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye guys.